Oh, hello guys, my name is Martin Alas Guspanda and today I'm gonna make the new tutorial for Altis Life and it is tutorial for uh, how to make Altis Life server. I know that the old one is not working anymore and now it's like Altis Life 4.0 or I don't know what version but I'm using it for one. I'm making again Red Moon server so and with Joe so I hope it everything will goes at its plan so yeah but now for the server you have to download Altis Life uh, zip folder link is in the description and now just extract extract it open it and first you have to do is uh, I'm gonna make another folder for the whole server so it will be server test 2 okay and from the folder steam in your altis live folder which you download it just take the steam cmd to the next folder open it and it will be just downloading right now and now you have to log in log in to the system so i'm going to like login uh, through the steam so your steam thingy password I'm gonna blur it so you can see my puzzle because you can see it here so it's kind of fucked up, but yeah. And the Steam Guard code, okay. And now, if everything is done, you have to type up upper update two three three seven eight zero, and it will be now configuring and downloading the whole server okay so when it's done you can close it close this window and go to the steam apps come on arma 3 server and back to your downloaded files go to the server and just put the X, e ext db with live server in the main root so when where is addons belay creator and everything else put the tats in here and tbb.dll and tbb malloc dll put also in here open mp mp missions and then you have to put the altis live dot altis in here in MP missions now that you have to change in the X XTDB in config X XDB conf um, somewhere around here Altis Live database username root and change the password to the password you have like I don't know one two three four or whatever do you have it or how what do you want on the MySQL. Open your tools. Install X. If you don't have the VC Redist, just install it. I already have it, so I'm not going to do that. Then open your MySQL full um, file. Install it. Oh, sorry, that was my email on the phone. And it will open this. Yeah, I'm I already have it so just click on next and next and next and click always on the first one do not click on anything else so that's it now you have to make mysql thingy so you can do things so I'm gonna close it and do it as you have it somewhere so I'm gonna open it, wait for it. So
So this will open in your Windows or whatever. You have to type grade here, click here on the plus. Connection name, it doesn't matter. So video server and that's all. Click OK and click on it. Again, log in. Click on, click somewhere here, create schema and name it Arma 3 Live and click apply. I already have it. So I'm gonna use this one. You have something like that, like Arma 3 Live, click double, double click it and click on query one. Now you have to open the Arma 3 Live 4.0 in your Altis Live folder that you download it. You can open it through the note, Notepad++ or I don't know if it's working with normal Notepad but I'm gonna open it with my Atom program. It's go good for scripts and everything else so and all you have to do is just copy everything in this in this file so ctrl A and ctrl C and paste it in the query 1 in the MySQL and click on that uh, this thingy bolt <coughs> yeah and it will install your Arma T life if there is only uh, green like things that mean that you're okay and good to go so just leave it like that I have the red one because I already have it installed so I can't like change it or whatever and that's pretty much no that's not pretty much it open your dust and server name okay so that will be red moon test maybe Password is for, for the server password, so I'm gonna use 12341, okay. Admin password 12341 or 5, okay. And that's all here. Rules disable uh, uh, voting, persistent battlefield, missions. You have to click on the Altis Life Altis, mods, XDB, and Live Server. And that's pretty much it. You have, you don't have to do anything else. Max players, you can leave it on ten or how much you want, doesn't matter. Or you can do like seventy, and I don't know. It's it's up on you. And just launch it. And that's pretty much it. That's whole tutorial for it. I'm gonna try. Uh, you have to save it like to the default. I can't save it because I have the. Um, default one for my Red Moon server. I'm gonna try to uh, open the MySQL so you can see like whole whole process of it or process. I mean the installer. I don't know if it's gonna work because I already have it, so I don't know. No, it's not. Working. Well, just install it. It will. It's easy to install it. If you have some problems, just message me. I can help you. So yeah, if there is anything wrong, just message me. I'm gonna answer you as soon as I can. And thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and other cool stuff. And I'll catch you in the next one. Bye bye.